Hello, my name is James Petruzzi, and I'm the founder of the independent game studio Discord Games. We've been developing 2D games together for the past few years, and after releasing our second title, we decided it was finally time to focus on our dream project. For the past five months, we've been hard at work on our third title, Chasm, a 2D action RPG featuring procedurally generated Metroid-like dungeons, tight responsive control, and authentic pixel art. Chasm takes influences from some of our favorite old school games like Castlevania, Metroid, Zelda, and Diablo. In Chasm, you play the role of a soldier who becomes trapped in a remote mining town on his journey home from war. Days before you arrive, rumors began spreading among the miners of a discovery deep in the mine. Not long after, a mysterious earthquake occurred and the miners never returned to town. With no one able to leave for help, your only hope of escaping is to explore the mines below the town, find the missing miners, and piece together the mystery of what happened. In the town, there are several NPCs that you can converse and trade with, as well as a tavern to rest at, store your loot, and save your progress. From there you can enter the mines and explore the procedurally generated dungeons, battle enemies, find unique and legendary loot drops, and gain special abilities to access new areas. We plan on the final game having six massive areas to explore, as well as a hardcore mode for roguelike fans featuring permadeath, scoring, and leaderboards. In the past five months, we've developed the game engine and toolset, fleshed out the art style, and began prototyping gameplay. As a demonstration of our technical and artistic capabilities, we put together a prototype for GDC that you can download for free right now. This demo is a rough take on the first area of the game, and is only a glimpse at what is to come. Unfortunately, producing a game of this scope and complexity full-time takes a lot of resources. We've invested every dollar earned from sales of our previous games, but we're now out of funds. Retro-style games like this one are a big risk for publishers that only target the mainstream. In order to get this game made, and keep full creative control of the project, we've turned to Kickstarter to have you, the fans, help us. Remember, if we don't reach our goal, the project won't be funded, and the game can't be made. With your pledge today, we can finally make the game we've all been waiting for.